Hi, Robert Anthony here for Mac Tuts Plus. One of the things that I love about OS X Mountain Lion is that it has an unbelievable amount of features that make not only using your Mac intuitive, but they really do make using your Mac fun. One of these features I want to show you is called Launchpad. Launchpad is technically an application in that it has an icon you can click to open it, but it functions more as a feature built into the core of Mountain Lion. Launchpad lets you see at a glance every application that is installed on your Mac. It lets you search, organize, open, and if downloaded from the Apple App Store, delete applications. To open Launchpad, you can click on the app icon. But if you have an Apple Magic Trackpad, there's a swipe gesture to quickly access Launchpad. If you pinch closed with three fingers and your thumb, like this, you will be taken into Launchpad. Once inside of Launchpad, pinching the opposite way will take you back out. When you open Launchpad, the desktop will blur away and a grid of app icons will fade into view. If you have your dock set to hiding like I do, it will also pull up, giving you a bird's eye view of all your applications installed. If you have an iOS device, then you should feel right at home inside of Launchpad. In the main area here in the center, you have a grid of icons of all the apps installed on your Mac. If you have more apps than can be shown on one screen, you will see these bullets below the app icons, indicating there's more than one page. You can scroll between the pages by swiping left or right with two fingers. Or if you happen to be a sharpshooter, you can actually just click on the bullets to scroll between them. Above the icons, you will see a search field. Typing in the search field, will give you live search results. I have the Adobe Creative Suite installed, so if I search for Adobe, you can see the apps are filtering as I search. If I continue to narrow down the search by typing I, you can see the app icons filter down even more to the Adobe apps that begin with I. Then finally, InDesign is the only app left. Hitting the X will clear the search field and the app icons will come back. You can arrange and organize the apps in any way you want. If you want to change the order of the app icons, you can simply click and drag them around. The surrounding app icons will realign themselves, allowing you to quickly arrange them. If you want to move the app icons to a different page, you simply click and drag like before and hold it against the side of the screen. The screen will flip over, allowing you to place the app icon on a new page. This is also how you can create new pages when arranging your apps. You can see that some of the app icons are actually groups of smaller app icons. These are folders. Clicking on a folder icon will open the folder and display the apps inside. You treat folder icons the same as app icons when arranging them. If you want to create your own folder of apps, simply click and drag on an app icon and hover it over another app icon a folder will be created and open. Releasing the icon will place it inside. You can change the name of a folder to whatever you like by clicking on the name title here and changing it. The name will display below the folder. If the name is too long, keep in mind that the name will be truncated to fit. If you ever want to get rid of a folder, you simply drag out all the app icons and the folder will disappear. Note that you can't place folders inside of folders nor can you place a folder in the dock. Hopefully this will eventually be possible. I think that would be pretty handy. You can, however, place apps into the dock by clicking them and dragging them to wherever you want them to appear. Finally, any app that you have downloaded from the Apple App Store can be deleted right inside of Launchpad. Clicking and holding any app icon will make all the apps begin to wiggle. You will notice that some have an X in the upper left corner. This means that the app has been downloaded and installed from the App Store. Clicking the X will give you a warning asking you if you want to delete the app. Clicking Cancel will cancel the deletion. And clicking Delete will delete the app from your Mac. Launchpad is a simple feature at first glance, but it's a simple attention to detail that make OS X truly the world's most advanced operating system and just plain fun to use. This is Robert Anthony for Mac Tuts Plus. Thanks for watching.